Well, so it seems I've come across a couple of Yidas. Now, I think they're admins because every time they typed, I heard a Yida sound. If it is them, then they might teleport away if they have work to do, which I don't like hunting admins because they're here one minute and then gone the next. You never know when somebody calls for them. The good thing about the staff is that if they're in a fight with you, they will not TP away. They are honorable or honorable people. Amazing people, for sure. Shout out to all the uh, hunting ground admins. You guys are the best. Love you. But if I do manage to get one of you, it's going to be good. But I have a feeling they're not going to jump down from there. And I'm not in a really good spot either. Unfortunately, a lot of things can come up from these sides right here that I don't want them to see me. And there's no real way for me to get over there. And I don't think I'm allowed to... Tr Maybe I can bite them up there because I'll tall the Rexes, but... It might be a rule break because I don't think I can eat it. Because of where it's at. <clears throat> well... There's no use in just sitting around. Because we could be here for a very long time. I was here for the whole night on the other side of that wall over there, hoping they'd come over, but it's daytime now, so I moved in. He's looking right over here, too. Or he could be looking behind them. I wonder what they're looking at. Uh, the bad thing is that if they jump ahead, if they do get down, I don't think I would have the speed to catch them. They'd have to come towards the building, and I don't think that's going to happen. Maybe if I get lucky. I'm pretty good on food and water right now, so I can play the long game for a little bit. Kind of contradictory, isn't it? Long game for a little bit. <laughs> I think I can play the long game. We'll see. See how it goes for the next couple moments. I could try to be aggressive, get up there, and scare them. Because of how tall I am, they probably won't know if I can hit them or not. gonna want to call in. I wonder if they can see me. I mean, I'm behind the wall, but if they went into sky camp for whatever reason, they probably know I'm here. Uh, I'll see. Yeah, there's no way they can see me. Come on, you guys have to get bored eventually. You're gonna need water. Which the water source is across the way. Something that I've learned in my time here is uh, trying to have a lot of patience. Because the more impatient you are, the more you're going to make mistakes. And if you wait for the right opportunity, you can get the kill. 
being patient is a huge part of this game. Very huge. You know, it is interesting, the way they're positioned. They're, f they're facing towards the inside of that construction zone there, and there's no alternating on the server. So, they might fall into it trying to get out, or they could jump over me. But if I rush them and scare them and then pull my speed a little bit, they might preemptively jump and run, and they might miss, and I might be able to snag a midair. That's a lot of what if. That's a lot of what ifs. I guess this is that point where my, with me being impatient, is starting to kick in. I think I'll title this video The Long Game. <laughs> Seems fitting. I've had an interesting night so far. I was able to take down a Utah earlier in the same location. And then I was able to take out a fairy that was a part of a herd up by Hidden Lake. Which is a really cool experience. I made a video on both of those if you guys want to check it out. Um, you guys can tell me what you think and what I could uh, improve on, stuff like that. Oh, maybe there we'll get down for the Ava. I'm starting to get hungry. Oh, he got down. <gasps> he got down. Oh my god, is he actually going to go for the Ava? He is. But you see, the other one didn't get down. Oh, is he? <gasps> no. This might be my chance. This is my chance. They're eating it. This is my chance. Definitely my chance. Unless they go out over there to get water. Yeah, where's the other one? There is the other one. God damn, he came out too quick. Yeah, buddy, come on now. Shit. I wonder where the other one is. He's probably still eating. He already warned him. Oh, they're both there. They're definitely there. What you got for me, partners? What you got for me? Come on. Come on, what you got? You come behind me and I'm gonna fuck you up. Come on. Yeah.
Okay, I got a safe stamina. Got to remember to safe stamina. I'm only halfway now. I'm gonna use how to use this to my advantage, maybe. Careful now. I almost bit you. Which way are you gonna go? Which way are you gonna go? Come on, enough of the one calling. You missed. You guys missed. Oh yeah, this is a good fight so far. Keeping me on my toes. I gotta start Z turning more. Oh, oh, almost. Oh, he's stuck. Oh, I should have charged them. Gotta remember the Z turn. Uh, careful. Oh, he's jumping on top of there now. I think they see my movements. He looks a little too scared. Uh, I'm not sure Timberbo Rex. I think I'm decent. Decent enough. Oh, careful. Careful, I got stuck on that. I see you over there, buddy, bucko. I see you. I see you. Come on. I'll lose the ambush speed for the turn. Uh uh, careful now. He missed. He missed again. They want to get close, they want to go for the bite, but they're too afraid. I don't really blame them. The next time he's facing me, I'm going to charge him. That's what Sticky always said. If they're facing you, it's a good time to charge. The next time he does that U-turn. Okay, one bite, that's fine. It's about time you hit me. It's alright, one bite's not gonna hurt. You shouldn't, uh, jump. Oh, the bleed's gone. That's good. Oh, he's stuck. He's stuck. Gotcha. What? What? Gotcha. Yes. Guy, he got stuck. <laughs> yeah. You can't do that. You have to. You can't do that. You have to call for it. 
You need to three call for that, dude. You can't just bite me like that. That's messed up. Oh, now you three call after you, uh, after you bite me? Get that. Got them both. It's alright. <sighs> got them both. That is awesome. You got way too cocky on top of that little structure there. But. A T-Rex survives another day. Well, take care, folks.